Greetings and salutations, rest of humanity and possibly aliens. It's your boy Freak Easy Gaming coming at you guys with another guide, and today I'm gonna be showing you guys all picket fence magazine locations in Fallout 4. So let's do this. The first place you are gonna to want to come to get your first picket fence magazine is a place called Salgus Ironworks, which is located not too far from the slog, not too far from listening post Bravo. And for those people who don't know where this is, here is Volt 111 for reference. Anyways, once you guys are at Salgus Ironworkers, all you guys are going to want to do is run on in through the front door. Now, you guys can also pick up, I believe, a unique weapon here along with the bobblehead inside the place I'm actually about to show you. Once you guys are in here, all you guys are going to want to do is follow the path I take. Now, I'm just going to run on through these raiders because I really don't have time for their shit. Anyways, once you guys do this, all you guys are going to do is run up these stairs here, turn around, run up these stairs run through this way you will eventually come to this ramp and you'll know you're going the right way once you're on this little metal form with the yellow railing you will then come to a wood bridge all you guys are going to want to do is cross that then you guys are going to cross this iron bridge here going up and then you guys are going to come this way down once you come down you guys are going to just keep on following the path i'm taking eventually you will come to a place known as the blast furnace all right guys once you are in the blast furnace you are just gonna follow the path I take come on up here and grab your picket fence magazine from right here don't forget to also grab your bobblehead once you guys do that all you guys need to do is get out of here once you get out of here you are gonna want to head to a place called Weaston's water treatment plant where the next picket fence magazine is located Alright, once you are at Weaston Water Treatment Plant, it should look something sort of like this. Be careful for super mutants like suicide super mutants like that, and a lot of other super mutants along with a couple of hounds. Anyways, once you guys get here to Waterson Treatment Plant, all you guys are going to want to do is go inside this main building. Alright guys, once in the Weaston Water Treatment Plant, all you guys are going to want to do is come this way, open this elevator, and go on down. Be careful for super mutants, I believe one of them does have a fat man, uh, just a heads up so nobody gets, you know, upset or anything like that. Anyways, once you guys come out of the elevator, you guys are going to make your first right, come in this building here, and your picket fence magazine will be on this desk here. Now let's move on to the third picket fence magazine location, which is located at a place called the Combat Zone. Now the Combat Zone is not too far from Diamond City, as you can see here, here is Diamond City. And here is the combat zone. Right below combat zone is DB Tech High School. Anyways, once you guys get to combat zone, I will show you what to do. Alright guys, once at the combat zone, it should look a little like this. All you guys are going to want to do is go inside the combat zone. Alright guys, once in the combat zone, all you guys can do is open this door, come on through here. And your picket fence magazine should be on this table right here. Now, if it's your first time here, you can also pick up a follower inside the cage. All you guys have to do is interact with them after you kill a couple of goons. Anyways, let's move on to the next picket fence location, which is located at a place called Hardware Town. Now, Hardware Town is right here just below Diamond City. Once you guys get to Hardware Town, I will show you what to do. Alright guys, once you are at Hardware Town, which again is located there on your map, all you guys are going to want to do is come on in through these front double doors. Once you are in the front double doors, all you guys can do is follow the path I take here, run on through this way, run behind the counter, run up these stairs here, make a left, come through here, come through this door, and the magazine will be on the desk along with the key. Don't forget to grab some decent loot out of that steamer trunk. Now let's move on to the final picket fence magazine location, which is here at a place called Beantown Brewery. And I'll show you guys what to do once you get to Beantown Brewery. Alright guys, once you're at Beantown Brewery, all you're going to do is come in through this door here. Alright guys, once in Beantown Brewery, you're just going to want to follow the path I take on over here. Be careful for raiders, they are extremely difficult to defeat. Just walk across this platform here. You guys are going to make a right. And your goal is to get into this concrete building here. Once you are in here, look to your right and your picket fence magazine will be right there. 
Anyways, I hope you did enjoy this guide. If you did, please leave a like and comment. It does help out the channel. And remember to subscribe for the best Fallout 4 how-to videos. All the unique weapon and armor locations, all the bobblehead locations, all magazine locations, and much more soon to come on the channel. Anyways, it's been your boy Freakies Gaming. I love each and every single one of you. I will see you guys right back here tomorrow. And remember, stay freaky.